Tonight, we travel to Louisville, Kentucky, where the Kentucky All-Star Choir is practicing for their performance on Saturday night. Some say it's the sheer amount of talent. Some say it's the acoustics in the 18-story atrium of the Hyatt Regency Louisville. No matter what happens, we're in for a very special rendition of our national anthem. But at about 10.59, I just started hearing people sing the first note. Say, oh, and more people joined, and then 11 hit, and that's when it was supposed to start, and it went silent. And then suddenly it started. No cue, no introduction, it just started. And at 11 o'clock, we'll begin to hear a note sung throughout the building. Um, nobody knows exactly who starts the note, but once you hear it, you recognize it. Everyone grows quiet, they join in. It, go, it gets really silent for a second, and then everyone starts in on the national anthem. It was incredible just to hear all around you, hear yourself, hear your friends, and hear these people that you've never met all sing the same thing at the same time and on this level that's unlike anything you've ever been a part of. It was amazing. It's surreal. That's the least I can say. Um, every year, it, it, it never... It never gets old, I'll put it to you that way. There's nothing like it, and um, it's just a touching moment to hear everyone join in and uh, really unify under one thing that really should unite us every day, but it's great that it's it bringing us together here. The atrium here has acoustics, unlike I've ever heard. I mean, like I've been in rooms with good acoustics, but hearing that echo and that bounce in that atrium was amazing, it was super cool. The anthem is special to me because this is what my ancestors has fought for, our country. And I, I get to sing a national anthem. I actually study sound a little bit, so just, just the way that the sound bounces off the tower. Of course, you're facing everybody when you're singing the anthem. And uh, it, it's just the acoustics make for a choir that sounds like one voice and when you have 600, 700 people that sound like one person, I mean that's the definition of unification and it's just, it's just a touching moment. Couldn't say it enough, I'm proud to be in this nation. I definitely remember singing, you know, the national anthem in the Hyatt. I remember these, the long rehearsals and uh, probably the performance at the end would be what I remember the most. The anthem to me has always been a moment since I was very young. You know, my parents taught me to stand up, be quiet, put my hand over my heart, take my hat off. You respect the anthem, you respect those who gave their lives to uphold what it states in the song. And, and really it's just you, you respect your, our nation. If you can respect our nation, there's always something, no matter who you meet, what differences you have, that you can you can agree on something and that's we are unified under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all, under the, the flag, the anthem in this nation. I just remember the sound, the big echoing amazing sound and how much I want to do it again. I don't ever video the anthem. I always call a friend. I always FaceTime them, video chat them because I, I'll never forget singing the anthem and the way it sounds here. And I want somebody else to hear that, you know, live. Because it, it's different looking back on a video. You can say, oh, look, there I was. But, I mean, the memory is clearer than any video I've ever seen. And no, no video can capture the moment.
spending the evening in the atrium of the Hyatt Regency Louisville while it's being occupied by the Kentucky State Choir draws sharply into focus the similarities between the choir and extension volunteers, reminding us that we are not an organization of soloists, but rather a choir whose individual members combine to collectively share their talents, skills, special abilities, and wide ranges into soaring melodies and intricate harmonies that create an impact so powerful and more profound than anything the world has ever seen before.